Ladies and gentlemen, between the two of them, my next guests have two Oscars, eight Emmys, a Grammy, two Tonys, and some workout tapes. <laughs> they now star in the Netflix series Grace and Frankie. Grace, I am a private person. Oh, you are the least private person in the world. First time I met you, you pulled up your shirt and said, do these things look right to you? Look, I haven't had time to tell you because my whole life has been working with you and sleeping with Jacob. This is why we need more coffee breaks. I have been there for every should I and shouldn't I with you two. How could you leave me hanging now? I don't know. You've made such a big deal out of sex in the vagina. And you were right. It, it is a big deal. Right? Turns out sex is pretty good with a man who's not closing his eyes and pretending you're a man. True. But condoms are hell to open, and having a pair of scissors on the bedside table just doesn't set the right tone. Please welcome Jane Fonda and Lily Tomlin. for being here. For inviting us. Thank you both for coming back. Nice to see you. Good to see you How again. How have you been? Pretty good. Been yeah. Florida. I mean, you know. I've been great. Good. I've been fantastic. Yeah. It's not a contest, but Lily appears to be winning, Jane. Well, <laughs> she's not as sensitive as I am. Oh, that's Things true. don't affect her as much as they affect me. Well, uh, you guys have known each other 37 years? 72 like years. 72 years. 72? 72 years. <laughs> oh, you guys met during the Hoover administration. <laughs> no, you guys, 37 years ago, uh, 9 to 5. Uh, yeah. You guys did 9 to 5. <laughs> kind of a groundbreaking movie. Yes. Kind of a groundbreaking. It's like it's a, a women's power in the workplace comedy, but I understand it didn't start off as a comedy. No, I, 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 I co produced it, and we started off with very dark. Dark comedy, and then one night I went to see Lily in her one-woman show appearing nightly, and what can I say? I, I was smitten, and I said, I don't want to make a movie about secretaries unless she's in it. And then on the way home, I turned on the radio, and Dolly Parton was singing Two Doors Down, and I thought, oh, my. Imagine if Dolly Parton played a secretary. I mean, you couldn't see her hands, but it would be, you know. <laughs> And so we had to, I said, but in order to get them, I got to turn it into a real comedy, so. Wow. Yeah. Well, it took a year to convince them to do it, if you can believe it. It took a year to convince with yeah. the four of you together to get that, that made? To, to get her and Dolly in, in, to agree oh, to, to, do, it. to yeah. do it. Yeah. I didn't Why didn't you want to do it? I didn't want to do a cheap comedy. <laughs> I... You're an artist. You're an artist. I was You're on Broadway. For, I was looking for something more, more serious. Uh huh. Then I had to persuade her mm -hmm. that I wasn't the right person for her. She's not kidding. <laughs> not kidding? It took, her it took a year to convince her, and then after a, a week of shooting, she asked my producing partner to let her go, and she'd give the week's money back. I'm You're not kidding. kidding. It's absolutely true. Is that true? Yes. She's Why did you want to back neurotic. out after a week? I, You're horrible no, to work I'm with. No, not neurotic. I, saw, <laughs> I saw, I saw myself on screen in the dailies, and I was talking to the birds that weren't there. Yeah, yeah. And I was not doing a good job. And I thought, oh, this is, I'm going to be horrible in this. I, it was only my second movie, third movie, I guess. So? so. <laughs> but you've stayed friends all these years. No, I was so glad. I saw, yes, the, I saw the next day's dailies, and I was so good. <laughs> That's the danger. So you I, can't watch yourself. You can't watch yourself. I, I do. begged her, you I begged her, let oh, me yeah. be in it. So I, I watch all the dailies from Grace and Frankie, and then I report to her. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, I do. Do you guys, did you guys, um... But uh, we, did, we I, did stay friends. Tennessee. You did stay yes, friends. Oh, we did, we did. We yes. did. Now, uh, I understand you guys did, uh, the Women's March out in, uh, LA. Los Angeles. <laughs> oh, really so shocked everybody. Seven hundred and fifty thousand people, men and women, baby carriages, wheelchairs. Dogs. It was amazing. Dogs were there. Yeah. Yes. You've done some protesting in the past, Jane. <laughs> there is. Right. This is you arrested for protesting in 1970. That's a good mugshot. Yeah. And uh, not everybody gets one that good. Um, I, I mean, I, I have to say, I was accused of smuggling drugs. They were vitamin pills. 
But the guy who, you know, who arrested me said he was taking orders from the Nixon White House. It was a frame-up. Were you on the Nixon enemies list? Well, I just, yes, I was. <laughs> and, uh, what an honor. I know. What an honor. I if, know. I, if, we, if we find out I wasn't on Trump's enemies list, I'll be very insulted. Don't worry insulted. about it. I'll be very insulted. You'll be there. Did you ever get arrested? Well, no. <laughs> Would you like a lawyer present before you answer that question, Lily <laughs> Tomlin? I would, kind of. Yeah. I would. Well, I'm going to point something out here, uh -oh. uh, Jane Fonda, if I may. I know what you're saying. Is that show. this is, this is, you're making uh, lemonade out of lemons. Here's your mugshot. And if you go to janefonda.com, you can buy a mugshot mug. <laughs> Did you know this is for sale? Did you know this was for sale? Did I know it's for sale? I don't know. It's my blog. It's my idea. Well, I don't know. I don't run the store at CBS. I don't know. <laughs> yes. I don't know what they're selling with and my face on it. And there's bags of, of my mug shots, I, I, too. I and all the money goes to my, my nonprofit. Okay. Well, good. It's for charity. That's nice. So, the revolution will not be televised, but it will be merchandised. I, I have an idea for a new yes. business uh, model for Trump. What's that? Uh, adult diapers. They could be called Trumpers because of, to help with all the leaks. Okay. Now, okay. Young ladies, now let's, let's, talk, let's talk about your show, uh, Grace and Frankie. Yeah. Okay. Now, in this, uh, you're two friends who end up uh, living together. Yeah. After your husbands fall in love with each other right. and leave you. Yeah. Okay. It's uh, um, uh, you you're, you're support each other and you've been friends for a long time. Uh, you go into business in season three. Yeah. What is what is the business you go into? Adult vibrators for older women. You see, at the end of season two, a very dear friend of ours gives us both presents, and the one that she gives me is a vibrator, and Grace has never used one, and she ends up with carpal tunnel syndrome. <laughs> and she can't read the directions because they're too small. So they decide to make vibrators for adult women mm -hmm. with, you know, very easily movable heads so that you don't have to move, you know. And then she comes up with this great sleeve, rubber sleeve, you know, that you put on, and also the printing is big, and the speeds, and the speeds show, glow in the dark, and tell what, her, Sorry, what glows in the dark? The, <laughs> the speeds, you know, slow, medium, fast. Oh. <laughs> good, good. And is your character on board with this? Oh, yeah, well, oh. I, I, I was familiar with vibrators before. <laughs> my, my character was familiar. Sure, one imagines. And, uh... <laughs> And by I, the way, and I've been told of... by CBS that we can discuss this as long as it's in the context of the show. The show and anatomically correct. And anatomically yes. correct? Really? It yes. has to be anatomically correct? That's what correct? we were told. Because I don't know of any penises that well, do no. this. <laughs> I don't think it's anatomically... <laughs> no, it's, it's for women. No. I know, but anatomically but correct no, what? What is it that's no anatomically slang. correct? No slang. Oh, no slang. I guess. Oh, you can't, can call, it, you can't call it. call it like a Steely Dan or something. <laughs> yeah. You can't. Oh, you know what? Tell her what. Tell him what the name of it is. What's the name of it? Oh, of no, the product. She'll criticize my French, but it's Menage à Moi. <laughs> there it is. C'est la vie. Lovely to see you. Thank you so much for being here. Is that here. it? It's, it's, it's the whole damn thing. Oh, my God. You don't God have to leave, but heaven. you can't stay here. Astonishing. <laughs> well, it's lovely oh, to see you both. Oh, boy. Thank you so much. Notice for being our here. Planned Parenthood pins. Oh, there you go. Well, did you get to go up and walk out? Oh, you have to go. This there we Season three of Grace and Frankie is available on Netflix. Jane Fonda, Lily Tomlin, everybody. We'll be right back.